Okay. Let's start writing our first C program. Okay. So the first C program we are going to write is very simple. We are just going to print hello world onto the screen. Okay. So let's start writing our first C program. First, we are going to include a file. Hash include std io dot h. Okay. This file uh, gives you functionality to output uh, output strings onto the screen and uh, take input from the screen for your programs. Okay. And then we want to start with main. Int main. Every C program has to have a main. Okay. And main sometimes takes parameters. And in this case, we are not going to give any parameters inside main as you can see. Okay. And uh, we're gonna have we're gonna start the program with an open curly brace and end it with a closed curly brace. Okay. And as our first program is very simple, it's not gonna have anything except um, a small function printf. Printf hello world. Okay. That's all. So it's as simple as this to print hello world out of the script. Okay. That's it. Uh, we are actually done. Okay, and uh, this thing is a statement in C, and every statement has to end with a semicolon as this one. Okay. Now I just saved it as hello world dot C. Okay, as you can see here. Okay, so let's compile it with GCC hello world dot C. Okay, as you can see, it has compiled successfully. And now uh, the executable is also generated as you can see. Let's run the executable. Okay. And now we're gonna have uh, hello world and uh, the prompt next. Okay. So this is just our first uh, program. Okay. Just just to summarize, uh, every C program has to have uh, some includes because we don't want to write all our C programs. You know everything from scratch. So we want some help, you know, some functionality already designed by somebody else for us. So that's what this std io does. Basically, io means input output. So this gives functions to input to the screen and uh, to output to the screen and get input from the screen. And every C program has to have a main like this one, okay? And uh, either it can take some parameters or it may not take any parameters. So let's just try it void here, okay? Void means it doesn't take any parameters, okay? And all C program has to uh, begin with uh, open curly brace and end with open curly brace. Okay, it's just the syntax. So when I, so just make sure that whenever you start a program with an open curly brace, you at that same moment you also put a closed curly brace so that you just don't make any mistakes. Okay. And uh, C programs consist of statements as this one printf uh, hello world is a statement, and printf itself is a function which is in the stdio.h. And it takes a string as a parameter, as you see, and it ends with a semicolon. Okay. Uh, basically, uh, this is just a first very simple uh, program. Okay. So why have we written a hello world program? Because you know all programs all over the world um, consider um, you know writing the first program as hello world because it's just considered more auspicious to do so. Okay. So with this, we come to the end of our first program. Okay. Have a nice day.